Geology in a jiffy. What's in the bag? It's... An introduction to faults. A fault is a fracture, or zone of fractures, between two blocks of rock. Faults may range in length from a few millimetres, to a few metres, to kilometres, or even thousands of kilometres. Wow! Most faults make repeated displacements over geological time, with movements occurring slowly, in the form of creep, or maybe rapid, during an earthquake, or due to a mine collapsing underground. The surface between the two moving blocks is called a fault plane, and can be horizontal, or vertical, or any angle in between these. A block of rock on one side of the fault plane can suddenly slip and move relative to the other block, either upwards, or down, or sideways, or squashed together, or pulled apart. These movements result in four main types of faults, which we can demonstrate using our two blocks of rock. The first type of fault happens when rocks are stretched apart, causing one block to move downwards in relation to the other block, creating a normal fault. In this photo, we can clearly see the steeply dipping fault plane, with the rock to the right having moved downwards compared to the rocks on the left. The second type of fault happens when rocks are squeezed together, causing one block to move upwards in relation to the other block, creating a reverse fault, such as in this photo, where the rocks to the right have moved upwards compared to the rocks on the left. The third type of fault happens when rocks slide past each other along the horizontal, the sliding either moving to the left in relation to where one stands, or, alternatively, the blocks could slide to the right, depending upon the forces in the area, forming strike-slip faults. A famous example is found in Scotland, where the most prominent fault in Great Britain, the Great Glen Fault, cuts diagonally across Scotland, the fault starting to move about 400 million years ago. That's amazing! The fourth type of fault does not involve blocks of rock, but instead involves plates, the faults being transformed faults. These faults, found at plate boundaries, occur due to two plates sliding past each other. Most transformed faults are found in ocean basins, where they connect offsets and mid-ocean ridges. However, a few occur in continental plates, such as the San Andreas Fault Zone in Western America, and the Alpine Fault in New Zealand. The four types of fault. Normal, reverse, strike slip, and transform. Please do watch our other videos about normal faults, reverse faults, strike slip, and transform faults. Please subscribe to my channel. Bye!